I'm currently in the Department of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science, and this is of course a field that I am interested in. So when I was in India, I was looking abroad internationally to see which universities offer this program. And then I was looking in Japan as well, because I've always wanted to live in Japan. And of course, if I go to university there, it would be a good transition point to go from studying to maybe living in Japan in the future. So I was looking to programs in Japan, and of course, I needed to look for a program in English, because that is my native language. So then I found Kyushu University's G30 international program in EECS, and I thought, this is a perfect opportunity for me, so I can achieve what I want to do, and that's why I applied to Kyushu University, and I'm really glad I did that. I think coming into the fourth year was definitely the highlight of my undergraduate study. It's because in the fourth year, I get to choose a lab in which I work in, and in the lab, I get to work with very state-of-the-art technologies in the fields that I am most passionate about. So I think this is what interests me the most. So my lab is called Systems and Control Lab, and in my field, in my specific topic, I'm learning about how robots, multiple robots can interact with each other and how we can control them in a very flexible and robust manner. And the applications of these in, is in any kind of mobile robot, such as drones or ground-based robots. I get to design the systems and the way in which each robot interacts with each other and obstacles. And also, once I do that in simulation and theory, I can also get to implement that in practice, in experiments. Well, I think the environment of my lab is very supportive and helpful because even if I'm stuck, I can always consult with my professor because professors here can speak both Japanese and English. So in case if I'm stuck, I can always ask for help from my professor. Also, this gives me the golden opportunity to work with international, other international students from all over the world and Japanese students as well. I don't think this is an experience that you can get if you're staying in your home country.